Hello friends, welcome to my channel, my Silparag Jambulkar. In this video, we will see order by clause in SOQL. So in SOQL, order by clause is used to show records in ascending order or descending order. By default, it is in ascending order. Now see, we have one example. Here, we are showing records from the student object, right? Now see, suppose we want to order it by column name or by field name, row number C, right? Now see how to arrange it. So here by this query we are showing records from the student object right. Now see we want to order it. For that purpose we have to use clause order space by. By what we want to order? So we want to order it by roll number right. So we will mention here roll number. So roll underscore number underscore underscore C. That is the field name. Now see, we will execute this. So here you can see 32, 35, 37, right? So we got this records with the ascending order of this column name. By default, it is in ascending order. But suppose we want in descending order. So for that purpose, we have to use one more keyword, DESC. DESC stands for descending order. So see, if I execute this, so here we are getting this records in descending order of this roll number right and if you mention ASC ASC so ASC stands for ascending order so see if I am executing it so see 32 35 37 right so ASC stands for ascending order and if we are not mentioning it still by default it is ASC only and if you want records in descending order so likewise you can show descending right now see uh, suppose you want to show records in ascending order of department. See, this was number, right? And it is string. So, that also we can do. See, suppose we want to show records by this department. Suppose we want to order this record by department. So, that will do. DEPT underscore C, right? We will remove this. Okay. Now, we will execute this. So, here we got this records in ascending order of department. So, see, C, ENTC and IT, right? So, this is the ascending order. In previous case, we have order record by roll number, right? In this case, we have order record by department, which is string, which is text, right? Now, see, one more example, we will see. Here, we are showing records from the lead object, right? Here, you can see. We are showing records from the lead object and we are showing ID, last name, first name, city and phone. Now see, what we will do, we will order this record by city. Okay, we will execute this. Okay, so see, here we got nulls value first and then we got these records, right? Now see, we want this record first and then we want null value. So that we can do. See, when we are ordered by city, so we got null value first, null value first, and after that we got these records, right? Now see, we don't want like this. We want this record first, and after that null value. For that, we have to add one more keyword: nulls last. Now see, what is the meaning of this? Null value it will show at the end, at the last. Now see execute so here you can see records without null value are shown first and after that we got null values right after that we got null value and suppose we want null value first so we can mention nulls first execute so see null value we got in the beginning after that non null values right so in this way we can use nulls first and nulls last by default it is nulls first in this way, we can use order by clause in SOQL. So friends, I hope you like this video. If it is, then click on like, subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you will get notification of my next video. So stay connected. Thank you.